And downtown, the front of the federal courthouse was blocked off with crime tape this afternoon because of a suspicious envelope that was found in the mail room. Police tell News 4 Jax a white powder substance was inside that envelope. The bomb squad was called in to remove it, and Channel 4's Destiny McKeever is live at the federal courthouse right now with the latest for us. Destiny. Well, Mary Tom, the good news, if anything, and all of this is that they were able to get that envelope out of the building without anyone getting hurt. And I did speak with a lot of people in this area as they were working and as the commotion was going, and they told me they felt safe because law enforcement acted very quickly. I talked to a couple of people who work in some offices around here, and they weren't even aware of what was going on. Pat Orman works downtown near the federal courthouse and saw the commotion today near Monroe Street as a bomb squad worked to get a suspicious envelope out of the courthouse. Our court security officer who does the screening found it suspicious and uh, alerted the, uh, our office, U.S. Marshal's office, and we took our pr proper procedures from there. JFRD also showed up with the U.S. Marshals. JFRD says the suspicious envelope was never opened. The envelope being further taken to an appropriate laboratory for sophisticated testing. People working say they noticed a lot of emergency vehicles, but they tell me they still felt safe. I think they got here and they did their job well and they took care of it. Now, investigators did tell us they know who sent the letter, but they're not able to release that information to us right now due to a pending investigation. Of course, we'll keep you updated with the latest on this here live and online at newsforjax.com. Reporting live downtown tonight, I'm Destiny McKeever, Channel 4, The Local Station.